Hey, you wrestling fans, and true followers, and members of the YWC. Brian Crazy here with the FN brand of wrestling and entertainment here on YouTube.com. First things first, I've been asked the question, what is the FN brand of wrestling and entertainment? As you guys know, we produce the wrestling blog, FN True Wrestling. We also produce a sister channel, FN True Entertainment, which covers video games, movies, news, life, books, whatever have you. We also have a group that we've created here. Well, it's kind of a group, but it's, it's not like a factional group like some of these people you've seen do. We have roundtable discussions. We sit down, we talk wrestling, we help promote YouTubers that have you know, fewer channel views, fewer subscribers, whatever have you, and we try to help them out. Not a lot of people helped us out. Big shout out to CJ of ADTV. A lot of you guys might not be familiar with him. Uh, due to some reasons, he hung it up last year, but he was one of the greatest shooters here on YouTube. Big hats off to him. He helped us a lot. Second piece of information, Eddie Guerrero's birthday is today. I believe he was 44. I think he was born in 67, if I'm not mistaken. And happy birthday to Eddie Guerrero. You are truly missed. Uh, one of the best Eddie Guerrero moments, I would say, that I remember is I had one of his shirts on, and I went to go meet Kurt Angle. And this is after he passed. And Kurt Angle looks up, and he goes, nice shirt, kid. And just the emotion in his face when he saw it, you know, it was just, it was a cool moment. It really was. I guess you would have had to been there to enjoy it, but... Eddie will be missed. He is one of my all-time favorites. So let's move into the big news. As you guys know, the walkout happened last Monday night on Raw. A lot of the superstars have promised not to return to Triple H Steps Down. They're going to hold the rally before Raw tomorrow night in the parking lot. Triple H's response is this, is he's got five superstars signed on. He doesn't know if he's going to have a camera crew. He doesn't know if he's going to have referees, announcers, this, that, or the other. But he said, we'll just wing it. And then when he asked about the superstars, if they did want to come back in, he said, hey, I might just lock them out. He might do a reverse lockout. So I'm kind of curious how this whole angle is going to play out. Kind of want your guys' thoughts. I mean, maybe Triple H won't allow them back now. I mean, this the storyline is definitely heating up. Raw is off the charts right now. It is doing phenomenal. And I can't wait to see, you know, how the storyline progresses week in and week out. When I get a little more information, I will bring it to you for the effing brand of wrestling and entertainment here on YouTube.com. Brian Crazy, as always, catch you later.